can I go to the forest without her? That's what I want to do. Where's she at? I gotta pick her up from school. <gasps> I wish you never made me deliver that stupid letter. What happened? What, what happened? The teacher read the letter out loud in class. She said that I was a snitch. That she made me stand with my arms up in his stuff. Bitch, I, I like, bro, <laughs> I couldn't be warned this time, Kareem, baby. Baby, give me that big, give me that shotgun, Kareem. The whole school. Oh, <laughs> the whole school gotta go. Started with your teacher first. Oh my god, we can't even trust the teachers. Siri popping up. <laughs> All right. No, thank you. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Not the iPad listening to me. But alright, I'm gonna write her mother. <laughs> I'm doing this type of sitting here right in the screen. <laughs> Dear Siri, I know I'm promised to leave you alone, but I have to write you now. Kareem has started school and what we fear is happening. She really needs to know the truth about her father. Could you please tell me more for for her sake? Kind regards. In the news, skybound conflict above Korea. 17 American F-16 jet planes and almost 60 communist MIG aircraft met in a violent battle today above North Korea. Buy your backpack set the Stinson Land Sport this week only. We have several colors and models handy for hiking. We also have a range of wonderful school bags. Right, well. Good thing I would mm -mm -mm. Alright, I can't remember if I read this or not, so I'm just going to read it again. She wanted to help, although she doesn't want contact. It's hard to understand why a mother would abandon her child, but many of the mothers who had children with German soldiers did indeed give them away. It is thought around 12,000 such children were born in Norway during World War II. Most of them two young women and teenagers like your mother. All right, I'm pretty sure I read that one before. All right, I'm like, it's time to go to bed, sis. I don't know why you didn't go to sleep yet. Hmm, Mr. Berg sounds like someone who might be strict. Could you read me a bedtime story? It's past your bedtime. I'm saying stayed up too late, bro. We ain't got no more time to do nothing. Wake up. Um, 
made this girl like a PB and J. All right, no school today. You pee. Live at home. Can you go? Okay, yeah. Let's get you ready first. Can you take it back? <laughs> Just stay over at Liz, bro. That's your bestie, bro. Oh, you're finally home. I want my bed. Alright, let's, let's get you clean. Yeah. No, maybe tomorrow. Sorry, Queen. We have enough time, girl. I'll make a fool. <laughs> I'm trying to make sure you eat well, yeah, I'm trying to go to bed. Oh, I'm so hungry. Okay, you want to go fishing with the fairy? Another picture. Oh, that's sweet. Turn out good, girl. I don't know who that is. That must be her teacher or somebody. That ain't me. <laughs> that must be her damn teacher. Who is on me? I think so. Anyways, I can't really remember much. We ain't never played hide and seek before. Did not see her ass. Oh, that's sweet. That Liv thinks you're funny, girl. Hello, 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 everybody. I hope we're all doing okay. I hope we're doing well. I don't know if I like my camera over here if I really want it, uh, like in this corner. I'm used to it being over here, so I think I'm gonna leave it over here today. But yeah, we're going to be continuing to uh, play My Child Left for him. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Alright, let's go ahead and get into the game. <laughs> Yo, what is good TikTok and what is good YouTube for catching this on the YouTube channel? You know what I'm saying? If you're on TikTok, say what's up right now in the chat so I can know you caught this live. If you're watching this on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Always make sure you, you come check out the Twitch. Check out the TikTok live streams because we're live all the time on those two platforms. And you know what I'm saying? You'll catch a lot of stuff that probably, you probably will see on the YouTube channel for like a good, a good 15, 30 days. You know what I'm saying? Because I got I to gotta repurpose the content and shit, you know? <laughs> It'd be a lot. But let's go into this game. We're going to be playing My Child. I still can't pronounce this shit. Le Ben's Born. I, I, I really have no clue. I'm so sorry to whatever whatever country this is, but I, I can't pronounce it. But let's get into the game. We I don't know what day we're on, but you know. 
okay it's august 26 we're taking care of my good sis it's sunday so you can come outside with me today girl I, I guess we're going outside today and if we have a fishing rod we can go fishing me and Liv found some berries too maybe we can go pick them all right why are you sad all right let's let's go to damn the store ain't open what the fuck well, let's get you some food the store ain't open bro i ain't got i ain't i can't Alright, good. We still have some food left over. That's good. That's good. Move my chair up a little bit. My chair be falling down. It should be irritating me. Um, but yeah, we gotta feed my good sis. Honestly, sis, like, this girl don't be open enough for me to really see him or feed my little child like this, but you know what I'm saying? We, we gotta do what we gotta do. <laughs> we have to do what we have to do. Give her a little bath real quick give her a nice little bath make sure she's fresh and clean at least you know what i'm saying go to the closet uh you want to go and draw yeah let's let's go draw let's go draw something damn girl oh what the fuck is that that don't look nothing like me <laughs> thank you for drawing with me this one turned out really good don't you think yeah it sure did like who is that though it's on me. She was the nicest lady ever. Wow, that's such a nice drawing. She must be lovely. Mm-hmm. She was really lovely to me. Yo, thanks, Mewing. Thank you for the following. Thank you for the like on the live, and I appreciate that. Think so? Anyways, I can't really remember much. Okay, I don't know who Ami is. I, I do not know who Ami is. I'm not going to cap. <laughs> But okay, let's look at this other drawing she drew. She drew us going fishing. So let me go to my study real quick. We can go look at our photo album. That's her and her friend Liv, you know what I'm saying? We got her getting bullied at school. I don't know why they let me favorite this picture, but they, <laughs> they fucking do. <laughs> her backpack that I got her so she don't get bullied in school. Oh, her first hand, look at her, her backpack. This is actually a pretty cute picture. Look at her and her backpack, sis said, thanks, mom. I got you, sis, I got you. We locked in, sis. We're locked in, okay, that's her going fishing. All right, I like that other picture. Uh, still don't have nothing in the book from her mama yet. I was thinking like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> oh my God, okay, we need to uh, go outside. I need to go to the fucking store. Why the fuck can I go to the store? It's actually crazy. Can I go to the woods? All right, we're going to the woods to forage for shit. So we don't have any food at home. <laughs> it's getting late. We should head back home. Girl, we had a lot of fun, though. We should stay out. We should stay out. Mm-hmm. It's getting late. All right, let me take you to bed, girl. I really like playing with Liv. She says I'm funny. And she laughs when I say my strange words, girl. What? What, what's going on with the words yeah strange words huh what you know words like ami oh oh okay i see what
I don't know why this baby just decided to go muted. Thank you, TikTok, for letting me know. <laughs> but okay. Let me make sure my cord's not okay. My cord is fine. <laughs> Wow, she said, please don't be mad at her. Girl, I'm not mad at you at all. Are you okay? They didn't hurt me. I'm just sad. You worked so hard to give me that pack pack. Girl, I can get you another one, sis. And I can beat them niggas up at school. <laughs> like, what? Okay. And I couldn't keep it nice and new. Don't, don't be sad, Karen. I, I'm going to fix it. I'm sorry I couldn't take care of it better. Girl, it's, it's not a problem. If anything, I'm finna go beat them kids up at school. All right, let's get you a bath and let's get you some food. I'm gonna eat three of these sandwiches. Damn, bro, you can't eat no more. You're sleepy. All right, let's go to bed. I wish, I wish I wasn't born. Karen, don't say that. Right, though, listen, girl, you're going to grow up and you're going to be an amazing adult when you grow up. So, like, don't don't even sweat about that. Don't even sweat about that shit, Karen. I'll see you tomorrow, Karen. Have a great night. I love you. Yeah, we got to go complain, bitch. Bitch, fuck them kids. Talking about some little tearing up my, 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 my daughter's backpack. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Thacker Strand School. Write the letter now and hand it to Kareen. Kare, I don't know if Kareen, Karen, I don't know what I should call her. <laughs> Some of the other children at the school have been cruel to Kareen. Karen, I'm going to call her Karen. I like Karen better. And yesterday they ruined her school equipment. I asked that the school do more to address this bullying problem before it gets out of hand. All right, let's look at uh, this newsletter real quick. In the news. Make tasty lingonberry jam, three kilograms fruit, one liter of juice, and two kilograms of sugar. Please use whole nice berries for jam. Boil the berries with the juice for 10 minutes. Put the sugar in a big jar. Pour boiling berries on top and stir. All right. I guess we know how to make berries now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this be that information. This, this that attack on Titan information. You know, you see a Titan get killed, and then they tell you how tall the Titans are. Like, <gasps> Wow, I didn't know why I needed to know that. I'm sorry, I can't help you. I have a new life and I cannot have it disturbed by mistakes from my past. Karen is also no longer my st responsibility. Do not write again, Siri. Bitch, fuck you, bitch. I'll write as many times as I fucking want. You had, you had that kid, bitch. You pushed that kid out of your coochie. Baby, that's your responsibility for life. I don't care. <laughs> wow. All right, uh, I think we read this one. Uh, you shouldn't think ill of your mother. It is true that some Norwegian women had German boyfriends because they could offer better food, luxury items, and parties. And some were also informers betraying other Norwegians. Norwegians? But most were young women who probably simply fell in love. During the occupation, there were over 34. 350,000 German soldiers in Norway in a country with only 3 million people. Wow. Many of them lived in private homes and many were still teenagers. When you grow older, you'll learn that you can't control who you fall in love with. Maybe she was scared. In 1945, when the war and five years of German occupation ended, many of those women were paraded as traitors throughout the street. Local mobs cut off their hair and they lost their jobs. Although not illegal to have a German boyfriend, uh, it was and still is seen as treason by very many Norwegians. Wow. The hatred towards the occupying enemy and their Nazi ideology grew very strong during the occupation. Now that we've been freed, all things linked to Germany are seen as evil. Therefore, many of these mothers are trying to hide the fact that they had a child with a German soldier. Others feel that it's impossible to keep their child. It's hard to get jobs and a place to live and any respect if you're known as a German slut. Ooh, <laughs> a German slut. No, that's crazy. Your neighbors will not let you forget. Wow. That's crazy, baby. They said, Kareen, Kareen, your mama is Norwegian, your daddy from Germany. 
They not, they not, the mix not mixing. Yo, what's good, Fernando? Welcome to the stream. You know, we just getting a little my, um, my child in. Got my good sis sleep right now. Oh, her mama just sent us a letter back. Uh, where's the book right here? Her mama sent us a letter talking about some don't message her again. That ain't my child no more. I'm like, that's your child for life, baby. I don't care where you abandoned it at. We found you, and I'm going to write you a thousand more times. <laughs> I don't care, Siri. You want to be named after the the robot on my iPhone, baby? You gon' you gon' you gon' get this baby some help. <laughs> you gon' get my stepdaughter some help. Cause of what? But okay, uh, I look, he need to make a oh, damn. Okay, she she gotta go to bed. <laughs> All right, I gotta go to bed actually. <laughs> Hello, I'm awake. Good morning, Karen. How are you? I hope you slept well. You don't you don't look very good. Um let's go back home. Let me get you changed first. Bam, put your school clothes on. Eat some food. Chomp, chomp, chomp. I don't think you have more time to do none, so I'ma just let you go. I know that big girls have to go to school, but it's really hard. Alright, take this letter to your kid. Take this letter to your teacher. And if your teacher don't uh don't 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 fuck with the letter, I'm gonna have to come up there myself. I don't know what to call her. I don't know if it's Karen, I don't know if it's Kareen. I really don't know. The eye is throwing me off entirely. Kareen, Karen, I don't know. I've been interchanging it. <laughs> I do not know which one her name is. Maybe it is Kareen. Maybe I was right. I have no clue. Do you think it'll help? Um I hope so, girl. Somebody got to listen, Kareem. Then I'll deliver it. Okay, thank you. I don't like the school, but at least you helped me. Of course, girl. What What else would I be here for? You know, go to school. Oh, I don't, I'm broke. I'm broke. Wait, you capping. I'm broke. Damn. I'm broke for real. I got to go to work. <laughs> I got to go to work. Uh, I don't think we can do no overtime. Okay, good. I'm glad we can't do no overtime today. Uh, let me get one of these. Damn, I'm broke again. Fuck. Okay. Wait, fuck, I didn't buy it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can I go to the forest without her? That's what I want to do. Where's she at? I gotta pick her up from school. <gasps> I wish you never made me deliver that stupid letter. What happened? What, what happened? The teacher read the letter out loud in class. She said that I was a snitch. That she made me stand with my arms up in his throat. Bitch, I, I like, bro, <laughs> I couldn't be warned this time, Kareem, baby. Baby, give me that big, give me that shotgun, Kareem. The whole school. Oh, <laughs> the whole school gotta go. Started with your teacher first. Oh my god, we can't even trust the teachers. You shouldn't have written that letter. Kareen, I'm sorry. I didn't I didn't know that was gonna happen. I didn't know that was gonna happen, Kareen. Alright, at least you're fully fed. Thank you for my food. I couldn't eat another bite. Alright, let's get you a bath. I'm sorry for being upset with you. I, I appreciate your apology, but I'm I'm sorry that you're in this predicament right now, Kareen. Girl, they right in front of the whole class. We need to get you some boxing letters, bitch. Fuck the letters, bitch. We're just going to teach you how to fucking fight. <laughs> We're going to teach Kareen how to fight because that's the only way these people are going to stop, baby. You got to put your hands on them. Clearly, words are not working. <laughs> that makes me feel better. I'm tired. All right, girl, let's go to bed. I'm sorry that happened to you. What is wrong with me? Nothing is wrong with you, girl, and I'm going to need you to realize that now. We're going to drill this into your brain. There's nothing wrong with you. There's something wrong with the people in the school and, and where we're at, Kareem. It's not you. It's no reason that those people have to not like you. Those people are the exact same people as you, baby. They bleed red blood. They are not aliens. They don't bleed blue. So let me tell you, you are no different from them, and they are no different from you. Okay. Like, come on. There's nothing wrong with you, girl. Stop thinking about them. Stop thinking about them. There's nothing wrong with you. 
Of course you're gonna get a bedtime story, Kareem. Yeah. Oh, I thought she fell asleep. I was like, no. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Have a good bedtime, Kareem. I'm so sorry about what you had to go through today. Let me say a quick prayer for Kareem. Kareem, Father God, please just keep your hand on her. Make sure that she is fully blessed and highly favored when she walks into her school tomorrow morning, Lord. Give her the confidence that she needs to stand up and to confront the people that put their discernment on her. Let her lift her voice up and sing and be glad in your name and in it. In Jesus' name, I do pray. Amen. Girl, Kareem, do not let them niggas fuck with you no more. I gotta teach Kareem how to fight. Boy, let me let me make some food real quick. Can I make some food? Damn, I ain't got no time. It's time to go to bed. Okay. <laughs> My bad. They be putting me to bed fast, bro. I'm telling you. It's morning. <sighs> Alright, let's get you some food, girl. Uh, let's get you in the school uniform. Uh, you're pretty much oh, okay. You're gonna be late. <laughs> Is it time to go? It'd only be for a short while, Kareen. Don't be sad. I'll try. I wish I could get her a new backpack. Like, why ain't got no more book bags in the store? Hey, I mean, what the fuck? Have a good day, Kareen. I love you. I won't be working no overtime. <laughs> I won't be working no overtime. We just going straight home, Kareen. They better not have did nothing to you. Why are people saying I'm a German kid? Girl, because your daddy's German. Your daddy's German, Corinne. I'm so sorry. Your mama was in there doing something she shouldn't have been doing. She was messing with that German man when she was supposed to be. I, I don't know. She should have been at school focusing on like a history book, but she was fucking with the other team they not fucking with your mama or your daddy bro you oh kareen i'm so sorry <laughs> she don't think she german but she don't she don't know yet they, they don't have no idea what they talking about kareen um so i just know that her 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 mama abandoned her because I believe her mother was Norwegian and, and this was when World War II was happening. So I'm pretty sure this was the same time uh, they had all the concentration camps and everything around. So her, her daddy is a German man. And Norwegians are not fucking with that. So her mama had to abandon her. Oh, the backpack. Okay, the backpack. They done tore that thing up at school. They said, Kareem, your daddy German, you don't deserve to have no book bag. And they tore it up. I don't know if I fixed it yet. I haven't seen the backpack yet. I assume she still got it. I ain't got to fix it yet, but yeah, that backpack got toe up at school, baby. Them, them bullies got it. You see, Miss Hanson, the teacher. How is the teacher bullying her? Miss Hanson is the teacher. Like, this shit don't make no sense. She's a child. Leave her alone, bro. She's just, she's just a byproduct of somebody else's bad choices, baby. Go find her mama and blame her. I'm trying to go find Siri and put her on the chopping block. Put put her daddy on the chopping block. Get that child off the chopping block and put her parents on it. Because she ain't come out of here from the magical blue sky, baby. She's a product of two people's bad intentions. I don't want to say bad intentions. She's just a product of two people who, 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 who can't get along. And the world can't get over that shit. Even Miss Hansen said it. She told the whole class that I'm a German kid. It's not true. You're a, you're a Norwegian citizen. Like, baby, your mama Norwegian, baby. You you from here. Blame your mama. <laughs> Blame your mother. It is about your parents, unfortunately, Kareen. It is unfortunately about them. Hey, Kareen, Kareen, you already experienced it so much. I feel like I have to tell her what's going on. There's no point in hiding this from her. She's already going to school where they're telling her you're not Norwegian, you're German. Baby, I'm mixed, first of all. Second of all, hop off my fucking nuts. Third of all, my mama abandoned me, so technically I got no mama or no daddy. Like, baby, Kareen, Kareen, I'm black, bro. Go join them niggas out. Now! <laughs> I'm telling Kareen what I need to, what, what I was told, baby. Kareen, this is going to be some hard information to, to, you know, relay on your little mind and your little heart. But I have to tell you this, Kareen. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Your father was a German soldier. He was here. 
in Norway during the war. Tell her, tell her, tell her, Kareem, your mother gave you away because your daddy, her baby daddy, was a German soldier. Oh. And that's all I know so far, Kareem. My my dad was was a German. Thank you for telling me. Girl, girl, we ain't keeping no secrets here, baby. It's only me and you in this house. Fuck am I hiding the secret from? <laughs> you? I don't have time for that. You are so very welcome, Kareem. I don't I, whatever history you need, whatever healing you need, baby, I'm here. We're going to find it together. Me and you are feeling this pain together, Kareem. All right, um, you know, you want to go to the forest? You want to go to the forest, pick some mushrooms or something? All right, let's go. Let's go eat some food. Chomp, chomp. Munch, munch. Chomp, chomp. All right, let's go take a bath real quick. I'm mad that took, took one thing. All right. Damn, I should have had her draw before bed. I should have seen that she wanted to, like, draw something. You could have helped me fix my things, you know. A story before sleep would be nice. Do you have time? Of course I got time. And I'm not sure. I did try to click everything on that picture. I definitely did. I'm not sure if the lake was open. I, I don't think it was, though, because I did try to click on everything. It's usually the forest that opens up, though, not the lake. Even though they do have fishing, so I'm pretty sure the lake should open. But I'm not sure. We got to try that one day with she. She at school or something. But all right. Good night, Kareem. Have a great night. Oh, baby, I just want to, I want to fucking do work at night. Chapter complete. Okay, she's 30% optimistic, 20% assertive. Baby, she got to get more assertive. 50% open. Okay, that's pretty good. You and 72% 72, 72 of others bought a backpack. You and 63% of others told Kareen about her parents. And you and 44% of parents did not warn against the German words. Hey, I'm sorry. I didn't know they was going to say that to her. Baby, baby, fuck, fuck them kids. <laughs> hey. Is everything okay, Corinne? <sighs> Everyone in school is calling me a German bastard, baby. Why you ain't a Norwegian bastard? Your mama abandoned you too. Why you can't be like, bro, that's why I hate kids. Kids are so stupid. You're bullying her because her daddy's German, but her mama Norwegian. Why you don't bully her because her mother's Norwegian? How? Like, that don't even make sense. <laughs> like, you're so focused on one part of the problem, baby, that you completely forgot about the other goddamn part. Her daddy ain't just fucking nut and, and she popped out. <laughs> that's not how babies work. <laughs> Everyone in school is calling me a German B. I don't know if I can say that word on TikTok, honestly. I want them to at least call me by my name, and they should. When will you let me know who my parents are? Well, I, I, I don't know who your daddy is. I know your mama. But you don't know when I, I know. I wish I could just show them my parents. Then they would stop calling me names. The local Vicar may have some helpful information. All right, apparently we got to go there. Okay, we ain't got no food, so we're just going to send you off to school, girl. Uh, apparently, you can't go to school yet. <laughs> she wants some new clothes to put on. If she want to play catch. All right, let's play catch. Did that make you happy? <laughs> school is hard. People there aren't nice. And Miss Hansen doesn't care if the kids are mean. No one picks on me in Mr. Berg's class, though. All right, you'll do fine. Just just make sure you pay attention. But I don't know how to do that. Mr. Berg says we'll have our first test on Tuesday. He says it's very important that we do well. Can you help me study when you get back? Of course, girl. You need to get A on that test, girl. It might even be fun. Time to go then. Girl, who gave you this jacket? Who gave you this jacket? I got to check if the lake works. It's not open now, but maybe it'll open when like we go home. 
All right, let's go to work real quick. Let's go ahead and finish this little session. We got 200 coins. Uh, we're not doing overtime today. I got to help my baby with her homework. Uh, I'm going to stop in the store. Is that some extra? All right, we're going to get some. You know, get some of the mm. All right, let's go home. Hey, how was your day? Mr. Berg says it's important that we do well on the test. Can you help me study? Girl, of course. Let's go study right now. It'll be fun. We're learning about animals. Here's the first question. Now, I don't see why you asking me the question when it's you that's got to study. I think I should ask you the questions. Which one of the following is a mammal? A, a duck. B, a salmon. C, a bear. Bitch, what? A bear? I had a feeling it was a bear. Which one is not a mammal? A, a gerbil. B, a swan. C, a moose. Bitch, I don't, I don't really fucking know. I knew that too. Okay, bet. Good job. You're good at this. Thank you, girl. I, I try. I try just a little bit, baby. Those were, those were some free guesses right there. I'm not even going to cap with you. All right. Last one. Which of the following mammals can be found in Norway? A, a kangaroo. B, a musk ox. Or C, a mountain lion. I'm going to go with that ox. That's right. They are in the... Dozer Vefjel? I don't know how to pronounce that, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to the Norwegians. I'm so sorry to, to Norwegian. <laughs> I don't even know what the country is, but okay. Sounds like a place where there would be trolls. It, it definitely does sound like a damn place where there would be some damn trolls. I like animals. I think we're done. Thank you for helping me study. Girl, of course. Girl, of course. Can we can we go to the lake? Like, I want to go fishing. Like, where, where can we buy a fishing rod at? Right, I'm really, I want to go to the lake, baby, because they be talking about going fishing. I want to go fishing, too. Like, I want to go to the lake. <laughs> like, baby, I was waiting for this moment. All right, let, let's play, let's play fetch since we, let, fetch, ooh. <laughs> let's play catch since we can't go to the lake, apparently. Apparently, that's illegal nowadays. Like, please, I want to go fishing. It's not fair. Like, what is over here? I can go to the store all day, and I can't go fishing. Like, what? That's actually crazy. All right, let's make some. Does it cost me time to make food? I hope not. Oh, damn, it does. Damn. All right, let's go to bed, Kareem. Let's go to bed. Studying is hard. I hope I do well. Girl, we study long and hard. You are going to do well on that test in that man's class tomorrow. You will. Good night, Kareem. Mm-hmm. Can you read me that story I like? Of course, girl. Wow. Thank you. Castles. We got big castles. It's a big princess in the castle. Ooh, the knight comes and slays the dragon. And he rescues her. Ooh. And she's going. She out like a light every night. Kareen go to sleep faster than me. Honestly, honestly, no, she don't. Kareen don't go to sleep faster than me, baby. Fuck that bedtime story. I've been asleep. <laughs> Oh, you why you dirty? Oh, you had a bad dream. I'm so tired. I had a bad dream. What did you dream about, girl? <laughs> Can't remember. I'm hungry. Can we eat breakfast? Of course. Do I have breakfast? All right, you got some toast. Munch, munch. Um, nom nom. Just to make sure you get that full meal. Yum. Thank you for making my food, girl. Of course. You don't never have to say thank you for that, but I always appreciate you for, for thanking me. Let's get that dirt off you real quick. Could you maybe walk me to school today? Of course I can, Kareem. Really? That's great. Can I change your outfit? We don't have enough time is what you're saying? Okay. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> we don't have enough time to change her outfit to go to school. Thank you for walking me. I don't know who the hell gave her that jacket. I didn't give her that big ass jacket and it ain't her daddy jacket, but I, 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 I don't know why we ain't asked no questions yet. But okay. <laughs> Thank you for walking with me. Are you sure everything is okay, Kareen? Yes, I'm fine. Bye. Kareen, like, I don't want to get bullied at school. All right, so.
So Liv does not bully her from what I know. Now I be a little confused because Liv be going to the same school that she's going to. So I be like, why ain't Liv standing up for her? I don't know. Liv ain't a good friend in my eyes, honestly, but that's her bestie. So hey, they, they wanna play ball together. If she ain't she ain't beating your ass, okay. You you <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but from what I know, Liv does not bully her. <sighs> hey, I'll be in my room. I have to study for my test. Damn, I should have did overtime at work if I knew you was going to be studying by yourself. <laughs> but all right, don't, don't overwork yourself. Is it time for food? Yeah, come and eat, girl. All right, let's go eat. Munch, munch. Let's see what she... Oh, they singling her out, bro. Look at them. They're big, fat, ugly. They're big, fat, and ugly, Liv. I mean, not Liv. Kareen. Kareen, you doing them big, fat, and ugly. And look at you. So colorful, beautiful, and bright. Please. I'm gonna need you to find your light, sis. Oh, no. They gotta tickle her. I'm gonna make her feel good. I'm sorry, Kareen. You can go back to studying or, um, bro, I want to go to the lake so bad. I want to go fishing so bad. Where the fuck is that option? I want to go fishing so bad. <laughs> I want to go fishing so bad and this shit is never open. Like somebody got to explain this to me. I want to go fishing so bad in the game. Like she's off school and I'm off of work. Why can't we go fishing? That don't make sense. <laughs> that don't make no goddamn sense. All right, we broke again, but at least we got food in the house. Am I right? <laughs> am I right or am I right? There's a there's a train station. If there's a train station in the game, baby, I, I this is my first time hearing about it. <laughs> it's never been open. I've only been to the forest. This train station has never been open. <laughs> Every time I click on that thing, that thing never works. Uh, but she good. Let's get her a bathroom. Maybe get her cleaned up. All right. You getting tired, sis? All right. Let's go to bed. <sighs> You're very quiet today, Kareem. Sorry. I've been busy with homework. Is everything else okay? Not really. It's... It's the kids at school. They're so mean. Can I come to school? Can I beat their ass? Why they don't ever invite me to go? Let me go to school. And let's see what they say. <laughs> they can't call me no German. <laughs> One of them kicked me in the leg today. Oh no, Kareen. Oh no, Kareen. Oh no, Kareen. Kareen, we're going to beat somebody ass. Now, get up, Kareen. <laughs> Kareen, you uh, apparently, apparently we ain't a strong enough parent, bro. Kareen, we be, uh, Kareen, we finna be, I'm finna beat your ass right now. You gotta get stronger. <laughs> you gotta get stronger, Kareen. You gotta get stronger, Kareem. You gotta get stronger than there, Kareem. Could you maybe uh, read me a bedtime story? Of course, let's read her a bedtime story. She's not gonna, she's gonna remember these times forever, bro. So the least we can do is be kind to her in these times. Even if we can't go and beat them kids ass. You know what I'm saying. Oh, damn, we ain't got no more time. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Good morning. Good morning, little one. Excited about that test? I'm not so sure. Yeah, on me, me too. I ain't seen Liv yet, bro. If Liv is a bully, I promise you, ooh, I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> Would you only look at it again? Yes, of course. Let's let's go. Let's go study. Let's go study some more. This is one question I really don't get. Let's hear it. Foxes. Hmm. Foxes. Are they a herbivore, carnivore, or omnivore? Uh, 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 I don't know. Okay, apparently they eat rats and, and, and berries and shit. I don't know. I ain't never heard of no fox eating no rat. That's new to me. <laughs> Yuck. Foxes are a little more gross than they look. Thanks for helping me. Girl, of course. All right, we got some more newspapers. Got those in a study. Looks like we got more mail. Let's, let's go read it, sis. Uh, I'm trying to go read it at least. I hope you ain't hungry. Vicar Peder Christianin. I don't know how to pronounce that, baby. I'm sorry. 
Fraggerstern Church, 5370 Fraggerstern. All right, we're, we're right in Victor. As you know, I took Kareen into my care three years ago. However, it has now become important to learn the identity of her father. Could you please help us find more information about her background from the sources available? All right, let's get that letter sent. Let's get that letter sent. Uh, what else they said? In the news, our system with two different adoption options might be chosen for our neighboring countries. We allow both weak and strong adoptions where contact with parents and inheritance rights are either kept with their biological parents or transferred. All right, that, that's some random information. All right, uh, maybe she's scared. In 1945, when the war, okay, I think we might've read this. Okay, yeah, we read this. I don't think we read this. I'm so sorry, Kareem. I know I'm meant to be a strong parent and your protector, but the reality is that I feel helpless. Your school is, on, is the only one around and I don't have any powerful connections in this town. So I cannot ask for help uh, with the principal. I don't know who to turn to, but I'll try to think of something. Dayon. I hope I wasn't selfish to adopt you, but some days I wonder. I have so little to offer you, and often I don't even know what to say. You should have had siblings and a two parents who knew what they were doing. Should I be strict making you stronger and harder so that you can stand up to your bullies, or should I shower you with kindness? to make up for the negative things you're experiencing. Or maybe just be as honest as I can. I'm so, so sorry. Your mother wouldn't tell us your father's identity, so I'll try to find out another way. I do understand why your mother might be too scared to speak. Young women with children by German soldiers have a difficult time. Well, baby, it's time for her ass to, to fucking a woman up and fucking tell us who the daddy is, baby. You made that decision, baby. It's time to own up to that damn action. That's why I like, baby, bro. And one thing I can't stand is somebody, bro, why you ain't owning up to your actions? Like, come on. Mm -mm. You out here doing shit and you, you ain't fucking owning up to your actions, baby. Don't do it then. It's that simple. <laughs> baby, you know what you should have did? You, you should have did this when you met her daddy. You should have closed them legs. <laughs> you should have said, you know what? You're German. I, I can't. Um, I can't. That's what her rash should have did. She didn't have no consideration when she was she was having she was chill trying to have have a love life. <laughs> but you know what? Love it is hard, bro. I'm not even gonna cap, bro. Um, I know she didn't go out there trying to find love. I'm sure her mama was not a Norwegian talking about some I'm ready to fall in love with a German man. Nope. She was just out there living her life. She just met a man who fit her standards and her lifestyle. And that didn't fit society's needs. I don't know what her daddy might have did. I'm not going to cap. I don't know if he killed people or not. That's the only reason I, I, I can't fuck with it. <laughs> but, <laughs> you know, we on, a, we, on a, we on a very strong line right now. <gasps> hey, I did really well on my test. Wow, Kareem, that's so great. I'm so extremely proud of you. Mr. Berg gave me a B plus. You know what I'm saying? B for Berg. B for Berg. <laughs> that's some great news. I'm proud of you. You see, hard work always pays off, Kareem. It always does. I'm going to study super hard for every test from now on. All right, girl, you you do that. You do that, sis. Fuck happened to your outfit? Nah, bitch, I ain't trying to tickle you. Why the fuck are the clothes ripped? Is it because you've been wearing it too much? Let me go change your clothes. Maybe we need to go sew it up. <laughs> Maybe we need to go sew her shit up. All right. All right, yeah, I think we need to go sew her shit up. Yeah, we gotta go sew that shit up. Her shit was ripped. <laughs> is it bedtime soon? It is gonna be bedtime soon. Let me feed you a sandwich real quick. Munch, munch. Damn, I don't think you're gonna get a story today, sis. You know, school can be okay sometimes. Kareen, I'm so glad you said that. I'm glad you believe that school can be okay because it can. You gotta stand up too, though. You gotta stand up too. I really like to learn about numbers and animals and stuff. Exactly. That's great, Kareen. Just keep focusing on the fun parts of school, sis. You're a child. You should be focusing on having fun and, and, and enjoying your life right now. A story before sleep would be nice. Do you have time? It's past your bedtime, Kareen. We don't have to we don't have to roll that over to tomorrow, but I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Love you. No bars. 
no. Why they let me favor the sad pictures? Period. She got a B plus. Smart ass girl. Somebody get her in Harvard. Get her in the college ASAP. We're learning about fishes today. Mr. Berg said I was a good student. Ms. Mr. Berg must be German too, huh? Or Mr. Berg just must be a person who genuinely don't give a fuck. And I fuck with you, Mr. Berg. Thank you. Y'all be caring about shit too much, bro. Like, why does why does it matter who her mama and daddy is? Why does it matter who her daddy is? Like, do you even know your daddy? You might be full Norwegian. Don't even know your daddy. Now what? <laughs> How you better than me? <laughs> like, what? I hope I learned something really fun today. Don't underestimate yourself, Kareem. You are stronger, smarter, and more beautiful and more fantastically amazing and wonderful than you may think. You know, we gotta we gotta speak words of affirmation into her. We gotta build up her character up here so she can build it in, up here in her arms and in, in her in her muscles and everything. You know what I'm saying? All right, um, let's see. Damn, you're gonna be late. Fuck it. Fuck it. There you go. Let me go. Let me go to work. Yeah, I'm saying no overtime today. All right, let's get some fish. I don't have enough money. Um, let me get one of these and then two of these. Oh fuck, I didn't buy it. All right, let's go home. <gasps> Girl, did you fall over in a pile of mud? Oh my, how did you get so dirty? The other kids, they flocked around me. Girl, beat their ass. Some of them started hitting me, but I didn't do anything wrong. It's not your fault, it's theirs. Why can't they just leave me alone? Some people are, will always be mean. Okay, I, I am, I'm on a bath. That's sick. I was sitting here bullying somebody because of their dad. Oh my God, and sister, sister, shut up. Like, fuck y'all. I'm like, y'all, I don't fuck with y'all. Bitch, how do I use the mandate? Am I just supposed to rub it on her or something? Okay. What is a, a Nazi kid? Wow. All right, girl, we gotta tell her all these things, bro. Nazism is difficult to explain. Some people think that it's a, a system or an idea. A system or an idea that thinks people are worth less than others. So if anyone should be called a Nazi kid, it's those damn bullies at the damn school. They have no idea what they're talking about. I'm so sorry they're treating you like this, Kareen. Do you think my dad did evil soldier stuff? Kareen, I don't give a fuck what your dad did. Your dad did shit in the past, and yes, that, that's another situation that I gotta handle with your daddy. You know who that don't got shit to do with? You, Kareen. You know who didn't do evil soldier stuff, Kareen? You did. You know who was just being a child and just grew up and just got beat up for no reason, Kareen? You did. And that's all you need to fucking know. I'm gonna I'm a find out the history about your daddy. No problem, Kareen. But I need you to know that you're only a product of this bad situation. Please, 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 please know this. I... I, I don't, damn, I don't want to tell her, I don't want to tell her no. Hey, yo, what's good, Vibes? We're just doing some mobile gaming today. We're playing this game called My Child, right? And it's like, uh, it's like World War II themed, so we adopted this kid. She got German and Norwegian parents. And she began bullied in school because her daddy German, and they not messing with that, you know? <laughs> we all know what the Germans was doing during World War II, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, she's trying to figure out whether her daddy was doing evil soldier stuff. I mean, he was a German soldier, so I I can only assume he, he was doing evil stuff, but I, I don't want to necessarily tell her that. Like, I don't want to say no way to know for sure when <laughs> this nigga might have a, a paper about it. I don't just say no way to know for sure. You know, I don't I don't know. I I don't I don't know. I don't want to tell her there's no way to find out either. Like, that's kind of crazy. I don't want to say he was a good guy because, baby, I don't know your daddy. 
I'm gonna just say I don't know it'd be very hard to find out but I want to know mm, the water's getting cold now all right eat your little sandwich eat your little sandwich Kareem all right you just want to go to bed you sure you don't want to draw could you do something together yeah let's, let's draw right now let's get your feelings out on this paper and somebody's ringing my doorbell let's see who the fuck it is I'm not gonna count these look like Jehovah Witness people, so I'm just gonna just gonna avoid uh, my doorbell right now. <laughs> Why is there Jehovah Witness people at my fucking door? <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> Maybe I I don't I don't need Jesus right now. I don't need Jesus right now. Yeah, it's definitely Jehovah Witness people. I'm sorry I got my headphones on, but they're in noise cancellation mode. But I see the notification on my phone. <laughs> oh, you're scaring me. Baby, I'm sitting here. Oh, no. I'm one of them kids. I be scared when the doorbell ring, baby. I be ready to run and hide. I be like, who's there? Why are you ringing my doorbell? Why are you at my house unannounced? <laughs> but let's let's get back to Kareen. You know what I'm saying. She about to draw a picture real quick. Um, There we go. Let's color in this dog real quick. What is this supposed to be? It's random. You want to pet or something, Kareen? So, do people hate me because of my dad? Kareem, that honestly might be the reason. Um, but, 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 uh, let me just tell her I think so. <laughs> but that wasn't me. I'm a good girl, and I'm glad you know that, Kareem. That's the thought, and that's the strength I'm going to need you to hold on to. Why are they mad at me for something I didn't do? They might understand the time and get and regret their actions, girl. Maybe. Do you maybe want to read me a bedtime story before I sleep? I don't got no time today, Kareem. You know what I'm saying? We took a long bath. I, I hope that's a good night for you. All right, got a new journal entry. Um, did we read this one? Okay. I don't think this place we live in is better or worse than any other small town. It depends on the people. I lost my job because they questioned my loyalty as a Norwegian for taking care of you. What? But the people at the new job don't seem to think like that. It's luck, I guess. Some people are nice, some people aren't. We can only guess. One third of German officers are said to have been Nazi party members. But many of the regular soldiers were just boys, forced to fight for the Nazis at the age of 18. If they refused, they would probably be executed. Still, German soldiers in Norway mostly thought they were lucky. Almost a third of the Weihermach soldiers were killed during World War II, while only 3% of the soldiers in Norway lost their lives. Wow. Let's look at these other pieces. All right, that's the last one we got. Okay, we ain't, we ain't got no time to make no food, as usual. <laughs> we always got to starve in this house. It's never no damn time to make food in this house, baby. I'll tell you that. Hello. I want to play with Liv today. All right, it's, it's Liv, bro. I got a love-hate relationship with Liv, bro. Liv goes to the same school. Liv, where the fuck are you at when my daughter getting bullied? Where the fuck are you at, Liv? Because you ain't there. <laughs> you not there, Liv. I ain't seen you, you pop up once. All right, let's get ready first, sis. Let's let, let me let you eat some real quick. Let me let you eat. Is that gonna take up time? All right, it, it did. All right, all done. Have fun. Liv and I are gonna play by the lake. Bye. Can I go to the lake? Can I go to the lake? Can I go to the lake? That's fucking crazy. <gasps> I can. I went to the lake. I can go to the lake. Skipping stones. Tap uh, the stones to step across the water. This doesn't cost any time units. Where the stones at? How the fuck do you do it? <laughs> How the fuck do you do it? How the fuck do you do it? <laughs> Why the fuck it's not working? I'm out here tapping it. Yeah, I'm out here tapping it. Like, what the fuck? Why the fuck can I, uh, can I throw it? My disc? Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Oh, okay, I gotta swipe it in the motion. Ha! Wait, yeah. 
yeah, I'm out here skipping stones. Yeah, cool, ass nigga. Ugh. Ugh. Skipping stones on a regular day. Ugh. <laughs> okay, is that all we can do here? What the fuck? Alright, it looks like. Wait. Okay, we can do something else. What's this? You've received new crafting materials. Okay, that's interesting. That is interesting. Let me go to the florist. I need to pick up some stuff. Look, it's some blueberries back there. Let me let me get them. Excuse me. There's some blueberries back there. Let me get some of them. I right, let me make sure I need to go to. Okay, can you go to the store? store. Stop. What you crying for? I gotta be live ass too. Was somebody mean to you? It w gotta be live ass. It was Liv. She she's being mean. Girl, her lost. Fuck that bitch. I already knew she was. Uh, man, they already knew she was tweaking from the jump. If she doesn't want to be my friend, then I don't want to be her friend either. Period, girl. Forget Liv. She want to be your friend. Then she let them other people probably get in her head. Tell her get over it. Wait. Okay. Let's um. Wait, where the fuck your closet at? All right, let me go make some food first. I guess we're eating cake for dinner. Wait, hold on, I gotta go to one first. I'm sorry for being mad at you. Damn, damn, she didn't, she didn't, she didn't curse live out. Maybe we could play for a bit. Yeah, let's play some hide and seek, girl. Let's play some more hide and seek. I'll go hide. All right. Where are you at, sis? Yep, found you. Oh, you found me. You have some cake, bro. This will cheer you up. That'll cheer you up. All right. Let's go get you to bed. Liv was so mean. Can you read me a nice story? It's past your bedtime, girl. I'm sorry again. You know, it's one of them nights. It's one of them days. Good night, Kareen. Mm. Did we read this one? Okay, World War II was the deadliest war ever recorded, killing over 50 million, 60 million people. A mere fraction of that, of that figure. And still very sad. 10,000 Norwegians died, but many were civilians. The occupation was hard. We had little food. Some people chose to work for, for the Germans. But many Norwegians suffered standing up to the occupiers. Ooh and the Nazi ideology. It caused people their jobs and sometimes their lives. It's no wonder the hatred that grew for those who were seen to choose material comforts over the fight for freedom and loyalty to their family, friends, and nation. Ooh-wee. All right, so we gotta go to bed. <laughs> they said we don't have enough time units. I'm up. Got more news in the newspaper. And then it's about to be 11. So I think I'm going to end this game at 11. I think I'm going to end the live stream because this shit does not let me like change my my title and shit. But I'm going to play um some That's Not My Neighbor next. I'm going to uh, end my live stream and just restart it so I can change the stream title and the game name. But I'm going to play this for like 10 more minutes. We done made it to October. Damn, sis, I wasn't reading what you said. I did not read what she said. All right, chomp chomp. You good, sis? I should go to school soon. All right, have a good day. Love you. I love you, sis. We gotta work some overtime on my bro, bitch. I was waiting for you. Wow, today, today, the one day you waited for me. Like, can I go to sleep? Okay, let's let's go to bed. We gotta take a shower. No bedtime story tonight. Sorry. I'm sorry, Colleen. Go ahead, and uh, Yeah, we gotta turn that light off. <laughs> Monday was a long day, girl. I had to work some overtime. Good morning. 
Let's get you some food. Gotta get her some food and gotta get her that protein. Protein or she gonna turn to a dope fiend. Damn, she don't wanna be late for school, bro. You gotta eat. All right. Like, damn. Now, one more no overtime. And buy some yarn so we can make first cars. Alright, can we go anywhere? We can't go anywhere here. Alright, let's go home. Oh, I'm glad you're home. You want to craft some materials with me? You want to make a scarf? Look, it's more scarf. More scarf. I'm tired. No friends, could you maybe read me a story? Of course, Kareem. Let's get that story in right now. Let's get that story in right now, Kareem. Have a good night, babe girl. Love ya. Wednesday, we gotta get to the weekend, girl. I'm, I'm trying to get, get through the school week. Uh, I'm so hungry. Here I am. Good morning. Fuck, I didn't mean to do that shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't mean to make the dress. I was literally trying to fucking feed her. <laughs> I was trying to fucking feed her. I miss my friend. Okay, you don't want to be late for school. Okay. All right, Kareem. She don't want to change her clothes. She don't want to be late for school. Okay. Okay. Then to go home again. Can't go here. I hate everyone at school. Every day is a bad day. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, Kareen again. Again, Kareen. That's crazy. Munch, munch. Yawn. Liv was so mean. Could you read me a bedtime story? Mm-mm, girl, maybe tomorrow. Good night. Damn, I got a letter to read, but can't read it because I ain't got no damn time. That time configuration be so, that should be going by so quickly. Uh, let's go ahead and read, get this next letter. Can I go for study now and read it? The mail is here. All right, girl, let me go read it real quick. Let me go read the mail real quick then if you must. Let me know about it. In the news, Noisy Guns, the new film, The Last Apache, takes us far out west in the days where men were men and women were rare robert taylor plays the hero in the dev with the devil's look falling in love with the lovely general's daughter played by arlene Dahl. all right information I, I i could not care less about and it told me about a movie baby i do not care about that in the news who allowed the reading of the short story achutang gnangu's fraudulent on the radio <laughs> with the scene with one of our german sluts and an officer it's disgusting especially for us who felt the wrath of the germans and don't forget from grimy prisoner 13,000. all right it's crazy when y'all say that in in the mail damn it's strange that the women that had exactly but that's how i feel exactly it's strange that the women who had children with german soldiers were treated less harshly harshly with other occupied countries than they were here we lost less people yet there's more hatred for these women when the war ended almost 5,000 of the women who are known to have been with german soldiers were interned into camp they hadn't broken any Norwegian laws, but were kept in prison-like camps for up to six months. This was worse than the punishment given to many of the Norwegians who worked or profited from the German occupation. Being in a physical relationship with a German soldier was seen as worse than treason, than dedicating to work for the Nazi system. Some think it's because it was easier to punish young women. Others thought that the women belonged to Norwegians only. Mm. 
That's crazy. Yeah, she's gonna be late to school. Stacking our bread up, you know what I'm saying? It's okay. But I guess she waiting for me today. See, can I go? I can't go nowhere in these places today. You're back then. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm back. <laughs> we gotta make all this food real quick. I'm like, well, I still can. Wow, that's crazy. Wow, my tummy hurts. Oh, let me know if it gets worse, okay? Well, I was trying to feed you. I was trying to get you some damn food, but I can't even... Okay, there you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, my God. No bitch. Not. Damn, she's all alone. All right. Good night, Liv. This is the first time she ain't asked for no bedtime story. She ain't asked for no bedtime story. She said, fuck that story. <laughs> She said, F that story, baby. I'm trying to go to sleep. I'm trying to forget about being alone. I don't feel so good. Yeah, you sound sick, girl. You should stay home. I hope I get better soon. You need some food, sis? You want me to go up here and chop you up something? Apparently, I can only cook two meals at a time per time slot or whatever. So let me let me not try to cook a third one. They gonna try to cancel me. Oh fuck! I only what like what the fuck? Ugh. I'll try. Don't you have to go to work? Damn, you're right. You gotta go to work. Go back to bed, Kareem. Ah, I'm skipping work. Let me skip work. Let me skip work. I call out. Let me write them a letter. Tell them I ain't coming. Let me write them a letter. Tell them I can't come. My daughter's sick. My daughter's sick. Why well, I couldn't call out of work? That's crazy. Where is that option? My daughter's sick at home, bro. They got some medicine in the store? Nope, they ain't got shit. Can I go to the forest and pick some berries? Some? I still don't feel good. Yeah, I gotta eat something. All right, let's let's go eat. Munch, munch. Can we eat? Of course we can. Here, here's some more food. Chomp, chomp. And here's some more food. Yum, that was really tasty. All right, let's go ahead and get you cleaned up. My tummy hurts because I'm unwell. And my chest hurts because Liv was mean. It, it just hurts all over. It's not all bad, Kareem. You still have me. I would never turn my back on you. Is it bedtime soon? I feel better. Thanks for letting me stay home. That's good, Kareem. I'm just glad you feel better. That's all I care about. Can you maybe read me a story? Oh, shit. I didn't mean to tell her it was too late. Damn, I feel bad as fuck. I did not mean to tell her it was too late. No, she feels all alone. She just laughed and closed the door. Mm -mm -mm. Good morning. It's Saturday, but I have no one to play with. Girl, I'm right here. I'm right fucking here. Shut up. Shut up. I'm right here. I won't be too long, Kareem. See you after work. Apparently, I gotta go to work on the weekends nowadays, bro. What the fuck? I can't do no half day. I can't do no half day. Anything new in the store? Nope. Nothing new here. Can't go here yet. Welcome home. My tummy is a lot better today, but I miss Liv. <sighs> Maybe we could do something nice. Yeah, let's go outside, Kareem. That's nice. I'm gonna go to the train station. All right, let's get some rocks. Maybe we should go look for it. 
fine. The lake was so still. Look for what? Yeah! That was a lot. That wasn't a good throw. What do you mean? What do you mean that wasn't a good throw? Now that wasn't a good throw. Well, I'm practicing right now. I'm practicing right now. When, when are you gonna practice? Man, you got me fucking up my throws. Damn, it's 11 o'clock already. All right, Queen, time to go home. All right, let's go pick some berries, actually. Let's finish this day off, then I'm gonna hop off and hop back on stream so we can play That's Not My Neighbor real quick. Let's get some berries and mushrooms. It's getting late. We should have that. All right, let's get you to bed. Yeah, you can go to sleep, of course, sis. You want a bedtime story? Me and Liv will never be friends again. Could you read me a bedtime story? I'm sorry about you and Liv, girl. Hopefully this story makes you feel better. Hopefully this story makes you feel better. She done lost her only friend. What? Her only friend was the biggest bully. Fuck Liv. All right, I'm gonna pause it right here. <laughs> I'm gonna pause it right here. Good morning. Fuck, I wanna know what happens though. I really miss Liv. Forget about her, girl. She's no good. All right, let me, let me feed her at least if she's not hungry. <laughs> let me feed her at least if she's not hungry and dirty. That's the least I could do before she got to go to school, right? Is she not gotta go to school today or something? Like, what's going on? Is today a Saturday? Yum, that was really tasty. Sleepy. Alright, go to bed. I don't know what to do. Everyone hates me no matter what. It's gonna be hard, girl, but we're gonna get through it together. I was scared when the bigger kids started pushing me. The scrapes from the ground hurt, but my chest also and my clothes. You had to fix them for me again. Why would they call me a Nazi kid? I don't think anyone is worth less. It's them. They think that. I even think... Stop that right now. Those words hurt even more than when they hit me. And, and Liv is going along with them. She doesn't say the worst things and she doesn't hit me, but she smiles to them and she's so mean to me. She didn't want them saying she was poor. She, she can go jump in a lake. Maybe my dad isn't so bad. I hope he's a hero. I'm tired. Christmas isn't too much. Maybe things will get better by then. It was nice spending time together. I have fun. Do you maybe want to read me a bedtime story before I go to sleep? Of course. Of course you're going to get the bedtime story, Queen. Alright, good night. 36% optimistic, 28% assertive, 36% open. We explain Nazism to Kareem as long as 64% of players did. 57% uh, of kids told her to forget about that dumbass bitch Liv. She wanna, she wanna go along with the bullies, bitch, forget hurting. And we managed to hold on to her trust. That sounds like a good day to me. Damn, 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 December 11th, damn. Okay, we gonna end it right there. We are gonna end it right there. You know what I'm saying?